Hey guys, Fee Freak 509 and today we're the third episode of Road to Tots Valbuena. And for the first deal of this episode, we picked up this tail off for 300 coins and we sold it for 750 coins for a 413 coin profit, which is not bad at all. Then we have this Dofonzo, by far the best deal of this episode. We picked it up for um, 21,250 coins, I do believe, and we sold it for a 6.3k profit, which was quite nice. And then we have this Bojan. Um, there was quite a lot of hype around this player as he just moved to Ajax, so his Barcelona card was out of packs and we made a decent profit on him. Um, then we have this Foster from West Brom and we picked him up in a 4-1-2-1-2 for 15,250 coins and we sold him for a 4,463 coin profit. Then this deal um, in a client for the client um, in a 4 one 2 it just shows how much the market can fluctuate as he was going for about 16k um, the previous day and now he ended up going for about 12k. And then we have this Lollavich for 900 coins and we ended up selling it for 1.3k for quite a decent profit or 3 and 35 coins. Then we have Titus Bramble, another good deal for this episode, in a 442 for 1.2k. And we basically just ended up doubling our coins on him and we started for a final price of 2.6k. And while this was going on, because those players were taking quite a while to sell, um, I had about 2.2k uh, as you can see in the top right hand corner. So I went out and uh, used the BPL 3 and coin method and I bid on a lot of players right here. And as you can see, we're just putting a bid of 3 and coins and we're hoping to sell them for about 350 coins to 500 coins depending on the player's popularity and then after 15 minutes as you can see I come into my watch list I came back and um, we're just listing all the players just depending on how much they actually like I, I see them in teams you do still see a lot of Kelly's in teams so I thought he'd be a popular player so I listed him up for 500 then we have a Reaper which we listed for 400 and as you can see all the players sold on the first go so that was quite nice quite a decent trading method to use if you don't have the most coins and I would recommend it. And basically guys, for the summary of this episode, we started off with 22,313 coins, and we finished this episode off with quite a nice um, total, which was 38,186 coins. We had a total number of 14 trades this episode, average profit per card was 1,138 coins, and the total profit of this episode was quite nice, which was 15,873 coins. If you guys did enjoy this video, a like would be appreciated, and I'll see you guys next time.